Hallelujah, 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 it's the time to worship you. Hallelujah, 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 it's the time to worship you. Hallelujah, 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 it's the time to worship you. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. It's the time to worship you. For you are wonderful, Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, the Prince of Peace. We give you honor and majesty, worthy of glory. We bow to the King of Kings. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. It's the time to worship you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Hallelujah, It's the time to worship you. Hallelujah, 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 Hallelujah. It's the time to worship you. Hallelujah. 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 It's the time to worship you. Hallelujah. 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 It's the time to worship you. Hallelujah. 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 It's the time to worship you. For you are wonderful, Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, the Prince of Peace. We give you honor and majesty, worthy of glory. We bow to the King of Kings. Hallelujah, 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 Hallelujah. It's the time to worship you. Hallelujah, 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 Hallelujah. It's the time to worship you. We come to worship you. We lay our lives down before you. King of kings, we give you praise. You are worthy to celebrate. Hallelujah. 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 It's the time to worship you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, 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 it's the time to worship you. Hallelujah, 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 it's the time to worship you. Hallelujah, 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 
It's the time to worship you all around the world. King Jesus, we worship you all around the world. King Jesus, we worship you all around the world. King Jesus, we worship you. All around the world, King Jesus, we worship you. Hallelujah! 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 It's the time to worship you. Hallelujah! 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 It's the time to worship you. We come to worship you, we lay our lives down before you, King of kings, we give you praise, you are worthy to celebrate, hallelujah, 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 it's the time to worship you, hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. It's the time to worship you all around the world. King Jesus, we worship you all around the world. King Jesus, we worship you all around the world. King Jesus, we worship you. All around the world, King Jesus, we worship you. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. It's the time to worship you. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. It's the time to worship you. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. It's the time to worship you. Hallelujah. 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 It's the time to worship you. Hallelujah. 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 It's the time to worship you. Hallelujah. 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 It's the time to worship you. Good morning to all of you, my dear brothers and sisters, and a cordial welcome for this inaugural Eucharist of the 34th Plenary Assembly of the Conference of Catholic Bishops of India. A very warm and hearty welcome to His Eminence, Luis Antonio Cardinal Tadley, the Pro Prefect of the Dicastery for Evangelization, who is presiding over today's inaugural Eucharist. Warm welcome to His Excellency, Archbishop Leopoldo Girelli, Apostolic Nuncio in India and Nepal. Welcome to our Cardinal Soswell Gracious and Anthony Pula, all our archbishops, bishops, diocesan administrators, secretaries of our CCBI commissions, departments, and apostolates. A warm welcome to all our major superiors, generals, provincials, principals of colleges, priests of the Archdiocese of Bangalore, other diocesan and religious priests who are present here, 
and officials of St. John's Academy of Health Sciences, the director, the associate directors, and all the heads of the departments. A cordial welcome to all our distinguished invitees and friends of CCBI. I now request His Eminence Cardinal Tagle to lead us in this Eucharist. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Peace be with you. And with your spirit. My dear brothers and sisters, let us acknowledge our sins, and so prepare ourselves to celebrate the sacred mysteries. I confess to Almighty God, God, and to you, my brothers and sisters, sisters that, that I have already sinned. sinned. In, in my thoughts and in my words, in, in what I have done and in what I have failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault, therefore I ask the blessed name all the angels and saints, and to you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us. Forgive us our sins and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. <clears throat> Receive our 
breath. You are seated at the right hand, the right hand of the Father. Have mercy on us. Glory to God, glory to God. Glory to God in the highest, and honor, peace on earth, peace to people of good will. For you alone are the Holy One, you alone are the Lord, you alone are the Most High. Jesus Christ, with the Holy Spirit, in the glory of God the Father. Glory to God, glory to God, glory to God in the highest, and on earth, peace on earth, peace to be. of souls willed that the Bishop St. Francis de Sales become all things to all graciously grant that following his example we may always display the gentleness of your charity in the service of our neighbor through our Lord Jesus Christ your son who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit one God forever and ever A reading from the letter to the Hebrews. Brethren, since the law has but a shadow of the good things to come, instead of the true forms of these realities, it can never, by the same sacrifices that are continually offered every year, make perfect those who draw near. Otherwise, would they not have ceased to be offered, would no longer have any conscience of sins? But in these sacrifices, there is a reminder of sins every year. For it is impossible for the blood of the bulls and the gods to take away sins. Consequently, when Christ came into the world, he said, Sacrifices and offerings you have not desired, but a body have you prepared for me. In burnt offerings and sin offerings you have taken no pleasure. Then I said, Behold, I have come to do your will, O God. As it is written of me in the scroll of the book, when he said above, You have neither desire nor taken pleasure in sacrifices and offerings and burnt offerings and sin offerings. Then he added, Behold, I have come to do your will. He does away in the first in order to establish a second. And by that will, we have been sanctified through the offering of the body of Jesus Christ once for all. 
the word of the Lord. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God. Lord, 
Lord of heaven and earth, that you have revealed to little children the mysteries of the kingdom. At that time, the mother of Jesus and his brothers came and standing outside, they sent to him and called him. And a crowd was sitting around him and they said to him, Your mother and your brothers are outside seeking you. And he answered them, who are my mother and my brothers? And looking about at those who sat around him, he said, Here are my mother and my brothers. For whoever does the will of God, he is my brother and sister and mother. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Brothers and sisters in Christ, we praise and thank God who has gathered us as one community of faith on this uh, memorial of uh, St. Francis de Sales Bishop. And I bring to you warm greetings from His Holiness Pope Francis, who knows that I am here. You are asked by him, please assure him that I really came and that I will bless him, at least for the first uh, full day. It is uh, my joy and my privilege and my honor to be with all of you, His Eminences, Your Excellencies, and our dear friends in the Lord. Our readings for today, I think, are providential. They are God's gift to us, especially to our bishop as they open the 34th Sinai Temple. In the first reading from the letter to the Hebrews, the, the author presents a contrast, or maybe better still, how the sacrifices of old reach their fulfillment. Part of the observance of pious Jews at that time, according to the law, was to perform ritual sacrifices, burnt offerings, most especially burnt offerings. There were also blood uh, sacrifices 
there were also meal sacrifices for the animal offered to God in sacrifice is shared by the community in a meal. They were ritual sacrifices. They involved the body and the blood of animals, calves, goats, lambs. And if you are poor, then you offer pigeons. But you offer the blood of a substitute offering. You offer the body, the blood of a substitute sacrifice. Well and good, but the letter to the Hebrews talks about the fulfillment, a more perfect sacrifice, which comes with Jesus. The word ascribed to Jesus and Jesus Christ, sacrifices and offerings you have not desired but a body you have prepared for me. In burnt offerings and sin offerings, you have taken no pleasure. Then I said, Behold, I have come to do your will, O God. This is the sacrifice of Jesus, not anymore a ritual, but the sacrifice of a holy life. It is not anymore a, sub, a, a sacrifice fulfilled by bringing substitutes to be offered to God for my benefit. No. I am the sacrifice. I am the offering. And there are two elements here. First is, I have come to do your will, O God. This total openness to God, this total availability to God, obedience to God, that is the sacrifice of the heart. And the other aspect is, a body you have prepared for me. A body that makes Jesus one of us in solidarity with other human beings, the sacrifice of communion with brothers and sisters. And in this body that I share with other people, I do your will, O God. This is the holy and perfect sacrifice pleasing to God which we immortalize in the Eucharist. This is my body, my blood for you. And done out of obedience to the Father. When I was a young priest, uh, I'm sure it happens also here in India, but in the Philippines, people are used to offering the fruits of the earth during the Mass. So for the preparation of the gifts, oh, you have people bringing banana, vegetables, many, many, many fruits, fruits of, the of the earth and of their, of their neighbor. neighbor. One, day, One day, someone offered a box. A box. So I accepted it. And handed it to the sacristan, who put it in front of the altar. And I continued with the Mass. Lo and behold, I saw the box moving, moving, moving. I said, what a miracle. What is happening here? So I, I called the sacristan, uh, please check. What is that box? So he took it. Then he came back, and with 
a reverence, a reverential attitude, he whispered to me, there is a chicken inside the box with some vegetables too. So the one who offered it was actually asking me to prepare a chicken dish because the ingredients were complete. No. I'm not telling you to stop giving those offerings for our priests, our bishops, and our sisters. Huh? I think they need chicken too. <laughs> but then I wonder, can the chicken say, this is my body. I have come to do your will. I hope the giver of the chicken could, could offer his or her body and do the will of God in solidarity with brothers and sisters. Jesus in the gospel, while appreciating his family, his blessed mother, and his brothers, Jesus referred to the people around him, listening to his teaching, and said, here are my mother and my brothers and sisters. Whoever does the will of God is my brother, sister, and mother. The family of Jesus is defined by imitation of him. He does the will of the Father. So who will he consider as brothers and sisters and his mother? Also those who can say with him, I have come to do your will. And here in my body of solidarity with brothers and sisters, we will all as one family do your will, O God. There is this consistency. And we know that the will that does the will of the will that does the will of the Father in solidarity with brothers and sisters is a will of love. Love will. Love to be true must be willed. If I am doing an interview for a marriage and I ask those who are getting married, for example, I ask the, uh, the, the groom, uh, so you are determined to give yourself for life you know, in commitment to this woman who will be your wife. If he answers this way, Oh, well, I will do. I have no choice. She's the only one who showed interest in me. So uh, I better grab her. <laughs> I think I will have second thoughts. No? Will I proceed with the marriage? Is this willed? Is this love? So in the end, the heart, the will, the body of Jesus is filled with love. That's his perfect sacrifice, perfect love. And our saint for today is known to be a teacher of love. St. Francis the same, known for kindliness, gentleness, motivated by love. He believed that in the church, in our mission, the only thing that matters is love. If it does not originate from love, it is not mission. If it does not end in love, then what do you call it? He believes that in every person, in the heart of every woman, man, or child, no matter what the social standing of that person might be, that heart already contains the love of God and there are cords being pulled by God so that that heart will beat 
with love, in communion with others, and in obedience to the Father. So as we open our plenary assembly, let us focus on Jesus, whose story we want to tell. Telling the story of Jesus. It is the story of the greatest sacrifice of a holy life. Doing the will of the Father in communion with brothers and sisters. Living in love. And as He has been sent by the Father in love, so He loves us and sends us also. In Lord Jesus, you emphasized that your church may be one. As we offer our petitions, mercifully listen to the plea of your church. The response shall be, Lord Jesus, receive our prayer. Lord Jesus, receive our prayer. Pavitra Catholic Felicia, और उसके नेताओं के लिए प्रार्थना करें कि वे आज के इस अंधेरे स्वार्थ लालच और असामंजस्य जो दुनिया और कलिसिया को घेरे हुए हैं इसके बीच में यीशु की व्याख्या भली भांति से कर सके पिता ईश्वर आप इन्हें आशीष दीजिए जिससे कि वे ईश्वर के प्रेम धैर्य और करुणा के वाहक बनकर मानव परिवार और कलिसिया को आशा और दृष्टि प्रदान करते हुए कलिसिया और मानवता को एकता बंधुत्व और सद्भाव की ओर अग्रसर कर सके इसके लिए हम पिता ईश्वर से प्रार्थना करें लॉर्ड जीसस रिसीव आ प्रेयर नमे आर्च से द कुंडी रखूं ஒவ்வொரு தலைவர்களும் அவர்களுக்கு கொடுக்கப்பட்ட பணியை புத்திசாலித்தனமாக கையாள வேண்டும் என்றும் அவர்கள் இயேசு கிறிஸ்துவை போல தொண்டு ஏற்பதற்கு அல்ல தொண்டு ஆற்றுவதற்கே வந்தேன் என்கிற எண்ணத்தோடு மக்களை உண்மையுடனும் நேர்மையுடனும் மற்றும் இரக்கத்துடனும் வழிநடத்தவும் குறிப்பாக மக்களுக்கு பணிபுரிய வேண்டும் என்றும் இறைவா உமை மாற்றாடுகின்றோம் ஸ்னேகமுள்ள கர்த்தாவே அவிடத்தை வயலில் வேலை செய்யுன எல்லா பிரேட்சித பிரவர்த்தகரையும் ஞங்கள் சமர்ப்பிச்சு பிரார்த்திக்கணும் அவரை எல்லா அபகடங்களில் நின்னும் சம்ரட்சிக்கணுமே அவரட பாதங்களுக்கு விளக்கும் வழியில் பிரகாஷவும் ஆகணுமே என்று ஞங்கள் பிரார்த்திக்கணும் Lord Jesus receive our prayer for for all who exercise authority over others that they may use wisely the power of officers extended to them leading and serving with love we pray to the lord lord, lord jesus, jesus receive our prayer
Father of love, you have called us into the fellowship of your Son and appointed us to bear fruit in our witness to the Gospel. By the grace of your Spirit, enable us to love one another and to dwell together in unity so that our joy may be complete. We make this prayer through Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. Amen.
pray, brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. Amen. May the Lord accept his sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and the good of all his holy church. Through this same sacrifice which we offer you, O Lord, kindle in our hearts the divine fire of the Holy Spirit with which you wonderfully inflamed the most gentle soul of St. Francis the Saints, through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere, to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, through Christ our Lord. For as of the festival of St. Francis de Sales, you bid your church rejoice, so too you strengthen her by the example of his holy life, teach her by his words of preaching, and keep her safe in answer to his prayers. And so with the company of angels and saints, we sing the hymn of your praise as without end we acclaim. Sanctus, 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 Dominus Deus, Abao, Pleni Suceli, Etera, Gloria Tua, Hosanna, in excelsis, Hosanna, in excelsis, Hosanna, in excelsis, Hosanna, in excelsis. Benedictus qui me, midi nomine, domini, Hosanna, in excelsis, Hosanna, in excelsis, Hosanna, in excelsis, Hosanna, in excelsis, in excelsis, in excelsis. You are indeed holy, O Lord, and all you have created rightly gives you praise. For through your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, by the power and working of the Holy Spirit, you give life to all things and make them holy. And you never cease to gather a people to yourself, so that from the rising of the sun to its setting, a pure sacrifice may be offered to your name. Therefore, O Lord, we humbly implore you, by the same Spirit, Graciously make holy these gifts we have brought to you for consecration, that they may become the body and blood of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, at whose command we celebrate these mysteries. For on the night he was betrayed, he himself took bread, and giving you thanks, he said the blessing, broke the bread, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and giving you thanks, he said a blessing and gave the chalice to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, 
which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The Mystery of Faith. Save us, Savior of the Savior world, of the world, by your cross and resurrection. You have set us free. You have set us free. As we celebrate the memorial of the saving passion of your Son, his wondrous resurrection and ascension into heaven, and as we look forward to his second coming, we offer you in thanksgiving this holy and living sacrifice. Look, we pray, upon the oblation of your church, and recognizing the sacrificial victim by whose death you will to reconcile us to yourself, Grant that we, who are nourished by the body and blood of your Son, and filled with his Holy Spirit, may become one body, one spirit in Christ. May he make of us an eternal offering to you, so that we may obtain an inheritance with your elect, especially with the most blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with your blessed apostles and glorious martyrs, with Saint Francis de Sales, and with all the saints on whose constant intercession in your presence we rely for unfailing help. May this sacrifice of our reconciliation, we pray, O Lord, advance the peace and salvation of all the world. Be pleased to confirm in faith and charity your pilgrim church on earth with your servant Francis, our Pope, and Peter, our Bishop, the order of bishops, all the clergy, and the entire people you have gained for your own. Listen graciously to the prayers of this family, whom you have summoned before you. In your compassion, O merciful Father, gather to yourself all your children scattered throughout the world. To our departed brothers and sisters, and all who are pleasing to you, are they a passing from this life? Give kind admittance to your kingdom. There we hope to enjoy forever the fullness of your glory through Christ our Lord, to whom he bestow on the world all that is good. Through him, and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen.
Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other a sign of peace. On you stay with holy speck mundi miserere nobis on you stay with holy speck sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy, worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, word and my soul, soul shall be healed. The corn celebrants as well as the faithful kindly remain where you are. The ministers will come for the distribution of the baby. I will come to you in the silence I will lift you from all your fear You will hear my voice I claim you as my choice Be still and know I am near I am hope for all who are hopeless I am eyes for all who long to see In the shadows of the night 
I will be your light. Come and rest in me. Do not be afraid. I am with you. I have called you each by name. Come and follow me. I will bring you home. I love you and you are mine. I am strength for all the despairing, healing for the ones who dwell in shame. All the blind will see, the lame will all run free, and all will know my name. Do not be afraid, I am with you. I have called you each by name.
I, the Lord of sea and sky, I have heard my people cry. All who dwell in dark and sin, my hand will say. the stars of night I will make the darkness bright who will bear my light to them whom shall I say here I am sacrament we have received, we may imitate on earth the charity and meekness of St. Francis de Sales, and so attain like him the glory of heaven, through Christ our Lord. Amen. 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 My dear uh, graces and uh, bishops and faithful, we are very grateful to the choir from St. Patrick's Church for uh, wonderfully animating this liturgy. And we would like to appreciate the dignified way of uh, uh, ministering to the altar by our minor seminarians from Bhakti Bhavan of our Archdiocese of Bangalore. After the Mass, you can unvest yourself where you are, the liturgical vestments. And afterwards, we'll have coffee break outside the auditorium. So, kindly gently move out after the celebration. We will begin the inaugural session at 11.30 a.m. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Our help is in the name of the Lord. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go forth, the Mass is ended.
Thanks be to God. So high it can keep keep us away. We will follow him, follow him, follow him wherever he may go. There isn't an ocean too deep, a mountain so high it can keep keep us away. I love him, I love him, I love him, and there he goes. I follow, I follow. My true love, my true love, my true love, from now until forever, forever, forever. There isn't an ocean too deep, a mountain so high it can keep, keep us away, away from his love. I will Wonderful choir, and uh, 